Hi there, Simon from simonwoods.com. Uh, the wine today, uh, ceci n'est pas un cigare volant. Um, so it's not a, it's not a, cigare volant is, yeah, it means flying cigar, but it's what the French uh, use, uh, the, the term they use for flying saucer. And uh, Randall Graham of, um, uh, of Bonny Doom Vineyard, uh, he has got a wine that's called Cigar Volant. And the reason he calls it that is um, it's his homage to Chateau Neuf du Pape, and where, uh, sometime in the 1950s, uh, I think the, the, the vignerons passed a decree that which forbade, 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 forbade? forbade? Forbad um, flying saucers from landing in the vineyards. And uh, it worked because no flying saucers have landed in the vineyards since. Uh, but ceci n'est pas un cigar volant. So I don't know why it's not, but it blend is 51 Grenache, 24 Syrah, 12 Sans, so 10 Mourvedre, 3 Cournois. Um, so it's not a cigar volant, but it is, however, enormously fruity, blah, blah, blah. Uh, an enchanting aroma of Montmorency cherries. Ooh, right, okay, well... But to stick my nose in there. Ah, oh, this is what wine should smell like. Um, this is, it's got freshness, it's got spice, it's got ripe fruit. I look at the colour of it, you can't see it against my uh, uh, dark jacket, but it's got, um, it feels like it's going to have that little bit of um, slight sandy edge that I get in quite a lot of wines from southern France but seldom get in wines from California. It feels like a wine that's going to be fresh, um, ripe, but never too loud, never too vulgar. What's the alcohol? 14%. Um, it smells enticing. And it's lovely. It's the wine, What it reminds me of, there's um, quite a lot of wines being made in, in Svartland, in South Africa, that uh, have this generous amount of fruit, this sandy spice, but a, a light bodied, not maybe not shy in alcohol. Fourteen percent is for, for Grenache is, is pretty much par for the course. But there's this delicacy about them, and uh, it's a, one one of those wines that you want to swig rather than sip. And um, it's Grenache is my wife's favourite grape. It's actually a toss up between Grenache and um, and Pinot Noir. And it's it's one of those that I think she's going to really enjoy later. Uh, this is, uh, as it is at the moment, it's just come out of a cool cellar. And I think that it's showing it's, it's showing probably a little bit too fresh. Uh, I, I think it, it will benefit from a little bit of, of warming up. But as, even in this slightly cool state, uh, it's delicious. It's one of those I want to, uh, I want to monster, to use a technical term. See you soon.